Hey there, Libra. It's me, D. Y'all, let's play some cards. Let's see what we got. Full moon <clears throat> is one thing that is going to be out and about as well as the sun. Leo is ready, rip, roaring. It's all over the place. All of everyone's stuff. So there you go with that. Anywho, strong energies. You are never too old to set another goal or to dream another dream. C.S. C. S. Lewis. Those names, initials, whatever. The things could be relevant and, and or, or not. Let's see. We haven't seen these in a while. Got one more. Only put off until tomorrow what you are willing to die having left undone. Well, ain't that some shit? We're already talking about death, huh? So get the shit done. You never know how long you have. I mean, that keeps coming up. You never know what the next minute's going to bring. Okay. So, and Pablo Picasso. You got the thing. Names and initials may, may not be relevant. I did grab a few decks today that I don't normally play with. I have uh, 60 something. And I don't even look at most of them. So, let's see. What do we have here? What do you got for Libra? What's going on with the full moons and the universe and the people everywhere? What are the major messages that Libra needs to know? Be aware of. Time to do it differently. Well, we already, we already heard that. You're never too old to set another goal or to dream a new dream. Do it differently. Only put off until tomorrow what, you're, what you are willing to die having left undone. Procrastination is not the thing. Go beyond what you have done before. So, do it. You are the breath. Listen and connect to your intuition. Trust your gut. Walk your own journey. It is essential to stay on your own path. So, always be doing the things that you need to do, not what all the other people need you to be doing or who they need you to be, Libra, because, you know, you're good at being who people need you to be. But the universe just needs you to be you and do the things that you need to do for your soul. <sighs> all right, well, let's see what else we got. Let's get into it. So for Libra, anxiety, fear, depression, it's a storm. Yet again, there's some sort of distress about the law, about fairness. It, it is stressful. Because nothing is fair. So everything is all fucked up all the time. That'll cause some serious anxiety. Anywho, next. What's the next energy? Emotions of desire. Maybe some masculine is uh, distressed or someone's distressed about a masculine, you know, flip-flop it, whatever. Oh, boy. But this is masculine energy. Archangel. Uh, I don't know. I can't talk today. Archangel Chamuel. Having to do with the community or a group of people and what the groups of people are doing or, or not doing. Because it's not fair. All right, what's up? What's that dove again? Peace, it's not fair. Uh, journey, movement, relocation. Uh, yeah, being on your path, getting there no matter what. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's this little sneaker? Success. So all this stuff is telling you to do some things and it's going to be successful. And you know, the haters are gonna hate. And the people around you are, I don't know, going to change. You're changing. The people around you are going to change. And some people may not like it. Maybe some people are changing because of a feminine. Or some feminine is changing because of a masculine. Or together it's the, the changing is happening because of the togetherness. Uh, let's see. There's one more. Truth be told, honesty, transparency, taking masks off. Say what you mean and mean what you say. 
Also, you know, the owl is very wise, aware, head on a swivel, watching people's sixes, which, you know, watching, watch it back. Eyes wide open, seeing people, the places, everything clearly is unfinished business. What's behind that? A caged heart. Somebody feels all locked up. They can't express themselves. Communication with the magician that just flashed by, but there's abundance and prosperity, new beginnings and finance and job opportunities. Let's see what we're talking about. I said I was gonna use different cards. Discontent and boredom. Well, okie dokie. There's the universe, front and center. We already were talking about that. There's a lot of things going on out there right now. A lot. It's extra financial change for sure. Material, financial, the set of rings out here. Anywho, carry on balance. Angel energy, awareness. There's the hermit. People are knowing some shits for sure. An epiphany. What's this anxiety all about? Money, financial and material changes. Maybe a lack thereof, discontent and boredom. Firm foundation. Maybe somebody's not paying attention to the things that are right in front of them because they are too upset about some other things. Emotional withdrawal. Yeah, pay attention to the stuff that's right in front of you. Uh, some of the stuff is not ma ma matching up. Okay, I'm gonna study today. Yep. This is These are two root chakras, so there's something with the family all messed up uh, and the beliefs. That's what I'm saying, like people are, are different. They are changing and some people are not gonna be able to come where other people are going. Some people are going to take a while to catch up or they have taken a while to catch up or to get in line, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. But there's someone off to the side that could, like, involve themselves in, in, in things, but they don't. Maybe two people off to the side that could involve themselves in a situation, but they don't. Or maybe they over, or the way that they do involve themselves is fucked up in some way. Exactly that. Heartache and loss, partnership and alliance. Sagamore Beach, huh? Sorry. Alright. Give me a couple more. I'm not using this whole deck. It's gonna drive me crazy. Next row, please. Solitude. Positive forward movement and alchemy, balance, magic, love begins, and then the disruption because of the light. I don't know, so like, why are people so angry? You know, it's like, the light is hurting the people's eyes. It's too bright. Triumph and success. With the hot chakra, there is um, a lot of love and some a definite awakening and leveling up, uh, victory and success. It doesn't feel all the while there's a waiting game. So I just feel like, you know, be grateful for the things that are going on right now. You can only deal with so many things at a time. And when there's so much going on, I mean, how, how much can you focus on? You can't do all the things great here. So I, I don't, you can't do everything, but you got to pick some things to do for sure. And you can't do it for other people. So, like I said, if you, they're not coming, they're not coming. Do not hasten your spirit to be angry, for anger rests in the bosom of fools. Yeah, foolish people. Put your positive pants on and smile. Psychic abilities. Hey, yep. There's no such thing as coincidence. 
also gifts a lot of unknown. Let's come out yesterday. The counsel of the Lord stands forever. The thought of his heart to all generations. It's definitely some sort of masculine, uh, huge presence here. No, your opinion of me does not affect my opinion of me. That's what I said. Some people just can't come. And you can't, like, stay back and wait for them or anything like that. Because that's just going to fuck things up. So, if you're not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you're determined to learn, no one can stop you. You can't make the people. Everything's about choices and you can't choose for everyone. But you can make choices for yourself. Don't study me. You won't graduate. But I don't feel that that's all the way true i do feel like there's a lot of lessons to learn here and if people put in the effort and listen and shut their fucking mouth then they would be far better off people are watching people that's a big spying card uh okay and i say all that because there's a, lot, there's a teacher on here so somebody needs to learn some shits and they, they don't think they have to but they do. all right one more <clears throat> Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. You only fail when you stop trying. Be doers of the world, not hearers only, deceiving yourself. See, people, keep, you can tell yourself whatever and believe it, but if you're not aligned and connected in the shits, then, uh, you know, somebody's a big fat liar. And they don't want to push yourself because nobody else is going to. I literally said something like that earlier. It's like, you know... Nobody's going to come knock on your door and be like, I have this great life and all these wonderful ideas and things that you should do and places you should go and people you should talk. You got to take the initiative. Sometimes you're wrong and it's okay, people, but, you know, you have to, like, out with it for the love of fucking God. Instead of just, like, making it worse and worse and worse and reasons why people are being assholes when you know you're just being motherfucking assholes but you can't be wrong because the ego won't let you let me just tell you that's the fucking devil right there uh ego snake deception jealousy betrayal backstabbing toxic silent treatment seduction counterproductive y'all the whole the whole bit is kind of the whole song and dance is what it feels like it's counterproductive the whole blow up the whole catalyst the whole uh, uh, where's the fire for some of these things it's like wow uh, off with their heads anywho people just are angry and want to hurt people and cut them down look at rivals oh my goodness challenge the status quo is a lot of um Let's just say stories that are not necessarily true. Some from the past, some from the future, and none about today, really. It's like, well, you know, if I do this in the future, then this might happen X, Y, Z. And because this happened in the past, I can't do X, Y, and Z. So nobody's actually doing any fucking thing. With this rivalry and the fucking standoff and the, the whatever the fuck the too many people here there's the moon and there's the box so the eagle is regal but it's all about new hope and standing firm longevity for the long haul but even bigger than that it more it's uh challenging the status quo people just don't want to everything's status quo not doing anything about anything someone's got to do something eventually an aquarius queen of swords air sign whatever the fuck but healing um my brain's stuttering it's a divine rainbow no it's a double rainbow and it's divine intervention a clear vision of the past, present, and future. <laughs> he was mad. Anywho, I can't with myself. Oh, the internet, when the people watching and stuff, and the planets all fired up, networking. The people are like resisting working together. It's like in the in in the benefit of the people. To work together here uncommon bonds just put your shit aside for the family for the greater good for fucking new hope new prospects there's aquarius again reawaken lost hopes 
There's a deep commitment here. The shit, the mask. It's not... It's unfinished business, y'all. So, who's so messy? Social media, social media, social media. The internet expansion. Somebody, I don't know. They don't want to expose themselves. The element of earth. Yeah, there's that stuck energy. People are like stuck in the matrix. Unable to lift themselves out. The realistic things are just un very unrealistic. People are afraid of like new experiences, of balance, of less chaos. It's like, I don't know. Do, do, do the people like, they like it. That's why they want to continue to endure it and persevere it. But I don't know, fucking somebody wants to hang Libra by a, by a fucking anchor with the rope. Send him down sinking. Off the side of a boat. I don't fucking know. People aren't seeing things like new experiences, wanting to see anything different. It's just the same old shit, like, amplified and twisted up. Chaos is the way. Anywho, I can't, you guys. And now it's like, on a record or something, it just spits out in between. Fuck off. All right, what is all these emotions with the masculine angel Chamuel out here? New beginnings. There's emotions of desire right there. These, this is desire. This is desire. This is a lot of uh, desire. It's like... Mm, it's in the throat. It's like pouring out of people. Like the progress... The new things, you gotta go do it. It doesn't matter about all this stuff, because that stuff is gonna just keep, it's gonna be there. Or it's, it's just gonna be there. It, it has been there. It's not gonna, it's, nothing is going to mag magically change overnight. And so do the other things, don't put off, don't put off anything, I guess, right? I have another card balance integrate opposite forces and so less passive more active less yin more yang for everyone some things they just have to get done like right now is very important in the moment being in the moment being spiritually enlightened about all these dark heavy whatevers and people's addictions and shits and, you know, knowing that the family toxic stuff is going to be there. The disillusionment, the, all of it. It's not going anywhere. Libra. Oh, my God. Y'all, did you just see this? Because we already had this out. This is abuse. It's painful. It's, it's, it's not very nice. Where's the equality? I mean, just this is all about equality. This is all about equality. The things just aren't fair. And so, I don't know, you're gonna make them fair? The same shit just keeps happening over and over and over again. Something is abusive, y'all. Somebody's got a, a lot of willpower. I feel like you kind of have to. Death. Not to die. Scorpio might be relevant. Because I swear this is going to end up with the motherfucking people wanting you dead. Okay? I've never seen it really come out like that. <sighs> Okie dokie. Can I have another one? No, three. Leo, twin flame, hot chakra, catalyst, the activation of the things that we've already spoke about, maturity, ambition, the, the there's longevity I've seen on like four cards already. 
uh, strength. So Leo season is very, very big. Also, you know, determined to get the things done. It's, na it's now, now is the time. Let them watch, whatever. Something about career is very important with the Lily and the developments. Independence. Attitude is everything. Confidence, confidence, confidence. What's up with the journey? The tower. Stand alone. Oh, these are very alone energies. You can't let anyone, none of us can. We all have to do the things that we are being called to do. Well, these are two very strong energies holding each other up. One in hierarchy and in, like, gnosis. And it, it's, this is more, um, like, business, too. Being guided. Something about the government. As usual. And that fucking towel that's outside my house. It looks just like that. Resources, more money. Because of your deep commitment, taking a leap of faith, a change in direction, and so what? Just do the things, luck, and prosperity. There's a lot of, like, good stuff around here. It's just wrapped up in a bunch of fucking shitty shit, and it's hard to be, like, excited and get amped about it because, you know, you still got to buy groceries and pay your electric bill. Oh, message, green light, do the things. Quite obviously, a visitor maybe. Uh, full speed ahead. There's a lot of movement, messaging for sure. About magic, about the sun, about, I don't know, some sudden unexpected end. Something may be over and done soon, although we just keep saying all these things keep spinning around and spinning around, but it looks like something's going to come to a conclusion. There's the fireworks again. Powerful climax, successful energy. And a new event or a happening or prob problem solving. Solving something violent or solving someone's breakdown or solving a mystery. Sounds a little Scooby-Doo-ish. Who's wearing the mask? All right. I don't know. I, I don't know who's wearing the mask. Let's see who's wearing the mask. I can't believe that whole just whatever. See, just keep it going. <sighs> the emperor is a masculine energy. The hyphen is being found out, is being washed, is being judged. Uh, the heart chakra was down there uh, with that other deck of cards. So uh, somebody's heart is, um, you know, healing, letting go of the things, but it's a healing love light that's going out for everyone. Some people just can't take it. They can't take the love. Stork. Whatever this is, it causes a big change for maybe something restless. The transformation, the, uh, some movement. The star is moving something. Someone's moving. Arriving and departing. There's definitely some traveling going on. The star and Aquarius again. King and Queen of Swords are out here. Breaking free. The Empress. So assertive. Someone, why is somebody so upset over here about what is this truth and the change and the restlessness? The Prince of Swords, the lovers, the soulmate is watching, Gemini, the ring. Because the things, there is no closure here. And somebody is sitting in their gnosis and in their truth about a breakdown or about somebody's breakdown. Somebody's trying to uh, lay a lot of shame and guilt on someone. 
just staying calm is um, not always easy, it feels like. The owl. Knowing things about people, about their feelings, about what they're trying to do, about someone trying to assert their independence but via, I don't know, estrangement. There's a lot of alone energy out here. Explore the unknown. Seeing through facades, the fucking fake shits, death. Seeing right into death. Which is transformation. Far reaching vision, third eye, a focus and a strategy, the ability to rise above regardless. Evolving of souls here. Growth. Stand firmly in your truth and in your gnosis and in your power and in your independence and assert the things and go the places you need to go and do the things that you need to get done in order to uh, evolve spiritually. We don't live for other people. Somebody doesn't leave their room. There's a lot of narcissism. This goes in the unfinished business here. Somebody's got monsters under their bed. Ugh, there's not a lot of sleeping going out here, going on here. Societal breakdown. That's what I said yesterday. Keep competing, not a complete, not a breakdown of all things here. The espionage, the lies, the hiding, all, all, all of it is ugh, corrupt business practice. People are being watched. news job applications celebrities what i don't know what everyone's doing here but also the mirror is about like who am i and watch out for the mirrors with the ghost right next to it because i have a feeling the ghosts are coming through the mirrors especially with this portal and the energy changing and if people aren't staging and cleaning and whatever the fuck here we go with the fucking poltergeist again natural laws of things in the universe is written all over some superpower shits here with the psychics and the gnosis of the things that are going on like all the stuff has already been written what is this the gnosis there's the intellect armageddon epic battle i was thinking of something earlier and i was like is that in that card and i don't even know what i was thinking of earlier but i'll just tell you more surveillance logic people just can't understand the things logically so i told you something's doing something like not very nice at all. There's the traveling. There's the news organization. Expect the unexpected for sure. Somebody needs help. Somebody is sick. Oh my God. There's revenge everywhere. There's the horses, which is uh, unleash the inner beast. So don't let anything hold you back. There's some phone calls coming in and success with business. And here we go with the assassination. Armor, suit up. It's gonna be some sort of fight, battle. There's war again. A business plan. Some sort of natural disaster, maybe. I just looked at the stock market change. I'm not sitting here reading all these, but whatever words are extra jumping out at me, we're gonna see how many of these. They're probably all. They're all happening. It's like. Seen the wine a couple times. Something to do with alcohol out here. Somebody's all boozy or bougie or, or both. Did I? I was like, all right, we're done. And then look what popped out. The killer. The people. The want people. To just fucking drop dead. Okay? Just drop dead. The parents. The family. This is, this is terrible. I, I wish you just didn't exist. Magic. That's, that's, that's the energy that people are putting out into the universe. An anonymous threat. Little do people know, like, who they're fucking with. Like, if you, people think that if you can't see it, it ain't real. Well, uh, check again, okay? Because it is. So, the revenge and all the fucking, I wish you'd drop dead shit. Uh, people just don't even know who's wearing the fucking crown. Very unaware of whom is mortal and whom is immortal. 
big, big mistakes. Femme fatale. Watch out, y'all. Watch out. Uh, idealistic organization is the government yet again here with the politics and the politician. This energy is the ghillie suit. Oh, things hide. It's like uh, the fucking Wizard of Oz too, yet again. People think they're pulling the strings and they're not. Bill B also with the turnarounds, quite obviously, but don't sit and wait for them. I was saying, wait, wait, wait. Now these guards are saying, no, no, no more waiting. And so there's some shift in the energy that's saying, like, all right, go right now. And so go right now. Toodaloo.